Who was Heracleitus? 1. Life History of Heracleitus An aristocratic family or class rejoiced at the birth of a son in 540 BC. The boy was named Heracleitus. However, he assigned the power rights inherited to him to his brothers. He really enjoyed learning something even though in the end, he would be criticized by Parmenides. There is not much information about Heraclito's life history because almost all sources about his life are anecdotes made by later thinkers based on Heraclito's thoughts. Finally, Heraclitus died in 480 BC. 2. Heraclito's Thoughts Just like previous natural philosophers, Heraclitus was interested in observing natural phenomena. He discovered that in nature there is heat and cold, light and darkness, day and night, war and peace, life and death. He understands that all these things are contradictory. This conflict always results in change. This means that nothing in the universe is fixed or permanent. Heraclito's famous adage reads Pantare Cayudin Menii, which means, everything flows and nothing remains fixed. This change was symbolized by Heraclitus as fire, the fire burns everything that is put into it. Everything that fire burns changes, while fire itself does not change, fire remains fire. Everything turns into something, and it changes again into something else. Everything consists of contradictions, but in these contradictions there is unity. According to Heraclitus, conflict is justice or can be called harmony. Light can only be understood in unity with its opposite, namely darkness, or life can only be understood in unity with its opposite, namely death. This harmony and change is called Heraclitus as Logos. However, the interpretation of the Logos referred to by Heraclitus is less clear. In Greek, there are two meanings, first, it means reason as interpreted by modern thinkers. Meanwhile, the second meaning of Logos is law. Heracleitus seems to interpret the Logos as a law that regulates conflict and change. So, Heraclitus believed that everything is contradictory, always experiencing change and harmony in that conflict and change. Thank you for watching, see you in the next discussion.